Hi, everybody. It's Miss Dory again. Can you see my screen? This is the shape of a pumpkin. Today, during group time, we're going to dissect or cut open a pumpkin. And we're going to talk about what we see on the inside of a pumpkin. After we've looked at it and we've talked about the things we see, it's going to be your turn to draw a picture of what the inside of a pumpkin looks like. So get some crayons or some markers, anything you have at home. If you don't have a printer to print this worksheet out, ask a grown-up at home to help draw the outline of a pumpkin on a plain piece of paper and you can color the inside. What does the inside of a pumpkin look like? We haven't seen it yet. But I want to see good details, right? What do you think is on the inside of a pumpkin? Use good colors like orange, right? We know pumpkins are orange, right? And what else do you think we need to draw inside? Maybe some seeds. We did learn about that. Right? What else is on the inside of a pumpkin? Use your crayons and your markers or colored pencils to add nice details to your drawing. Really think about all the things we saw inside a pumpkin on our group time today. Either before or after you draw the inside of your pumpkin, I have some vocabulary words for you to practice with your grown-ups at home. All right, look at the picture for a clue. What do you think this word says? Pumpkin, right? Because here's a picture of a pumpkin. What do you think this word says? Look what it's pointing to. The stem. Great job. And if you look, I have one, two, three, four more picture cards for you to read. These are all the parts of the pumpkin that we talked about and looked at in group time today. All right, my friends, send me a picture of what the inside of your pumpkin looks like when you're all done. Good luck drawing and learning. I had so much fun opening up this pumpkin with you today. Bye, friends.